we adventured out from the hotel for the second time. Um, this time we've got like a massive day out. We're going to visit a load of different places. Um, we're actually in Ubud at the moment. And as you can see, we've got a lot of stuff in front of us. Um, we've come to a coffee plantain. Um, and it's slightly different to what everyone else is used to. Um, this coffee comes from an animal. Yes. So we are actually drinking um, coffee poo. Animal poo. Poo coffee. <laughs> and I'm not gonna lie. It is incredible, isn't it? It tastes delicious, yeah. So the animal is a luwak, which is a local animal. It's like a small fox cat type. And the animals are fed the beans, and then obviously it goes what through goes them. in <laughs> comes out. And then the beans are yeah, collected. Yeah. Um, there's an actual job for someone that collects animal poo. Yeah, there so is. Our guide is just here. Um, um, am I allowed to call it poo coffee? Is that okay? Cat poop chino. Cat, cat poop. <laughs> cat poop chino. Very good. Like like cappuccino, yeah. but cat poop. I like that. It's very good. Very good. Experience. The coffee, I think, is probably the best coffee I've ever tried. I was going to say that, that we wasn't just, you know, obviously the woman who took us on the little tour was there. We weren't just sent to be polite. It was really good coffee. Yeah, really good coffee. And we've so much bought that some. we bought some, yeah. yeah. Um, and we can take it back, which is really good. Um, but we are now off to the place I've been waiting to go to. <laughs> I knew you were going to say that. Moon. We are going to the monkey forest. I absolutely love monkeys. I cannot wait. This is going to be have one here. a real good experience for us, so yeah, nearly there. <laughs> Are you ready, Luce? They're going to get you in the dark. We've literally just walked in now, and you're about to see Lucy's face light up. So. It is lit up already. Okay, we can, we can see our first monkey, and we can hear them. Go on, Luce. Now remember, remember what happened last time you tried to touch something, oh, yeah? I'm trying not to be scared. It yeah, got, yeah, attacked me. Yeah. So it does say, don't run, don't panic, keep calm and don't scream, all right? You gonna be I'm all right? I'm already panicking. Are you panicking? <laughs> They're so pretty, aren't they? Hello, mate.
I like his big balls. Are you still recording, yeah? Yeah. yeah. I can hear him chewing in my ear. <laughs> He's literally just getting his munch on. Yeah? I feel like the other one wanted to join you. He's just... Yeah? He knows now. Oh, ah, he wants the food. Come on, come back to me. <laughs> He's wicked. Look, he's very cute. Good monkey. Yeah, good monkey. This is an um, experience I never thought we'd have. I thought we were just going to go around and see them all, but this is pretty spectacular. Yeah, so. it really is. It's wicked. And I'm sorry if I'm shaking the camera. <laughs> it's quite nerve wracking with them being up here. Are they not fed um, bananas normally? No. No. Okay. So. That is the trick. You're not meant to feed them, but bananas work. So. It's, it's just he's monkey. proper relaxing. Is he gonna? Do <laughs> Still waiting the banana. He's <laughs> tickling you. <laughs> he's not gonna poo on me. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he just yawned. You just saw all his teeth. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, jump. Oh, sleepy. Yeah, yeah, you saw them that time, did you? <laughs> bye then. Okay, bye, thank you. Hi, monkey. Bye. This is your pee. Ah, good monkey. Thank you. So we've just come out and that was incredible. I think it? that's one of the best things I've ever done. Like to have a monkey on you. Who can say they've had that? I mean, yeah, it's getting busy now. Um, and this is the good thing about having the guide is that he takes us in a less busy time and he did the banana trick. We didn't see anyone else with the monkey on their shoulder. No. There is, okay, so we didn't talk too much in there because we were trying to get a little bit of footage and just enjoy the time. It is only one kilometer in area, yeah. I think he said and it houses just over a thousand monkeys and four different tribes. Uh, that's why there was a little bit of fighting in between. What an experience. I mean, you can not you, you can walk all the way around. And it's like they've built it purposely um, so that the monkeys, you know, you don't... You don't get involved in their home. In their habitat, yeah. exactly. Um, I think, so I had a, a view of how I thought it was gonna be and that was nothing like that. It was like a hundred times better than I thought it was gonna be. And I was looking forward to it, yeah. so I'm going to be smiling all day. <laughs> Good. Um, they, they do make a mess. Yeah, you need to change your top. I have got a spare t-shirt, so <laughs> we're going to change that, but spectacular. Yeah. Really, really, really good. That has been the best part of Bali so far. We did say we wanted to go out and explore. Yeah. Spectacular. But now we're on to the next stop. Let's go. fields now um, it's absolutely beautiful um, there's a few things going on here apparently it's not the biggest rice field in Bali but it looks massive to yeah. us doesn't it yeah it does well we've never seen a rice field before have we no this is a first um, our, our guide said that it takes three months to grow the white rice yeah and four months to grow the brown and black rice mm -hmm. um, I obviously have seen it on TV like how they do it but never really understood it and it's massive it here, it's massive. so cool. It is just beautiful. I think, I think I could stay here for a while and just look. Now we're at the barley swing and I didn't think it was going to be this big.
back. <laughs> wow. Yeah. This is all loose. She's going to take control of this one. I'm just going to stand here and film her. So you're actually swinging over the rice field. You're, you're scared of heights, aren't you? <laughs> Sign your life away, loose. Yeah. How are you feeling? Um, I'm all right. Actually. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. I think it's because I saw someone do it. <laughs> Oh, maybe not now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a bit close. Okay. Good luck, Liz. <laughs> oh, wow. This is high. Are you ready, Lucy? Yeah, yeah, I'm good. Okay, one, two, go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez. Going back. <laughs> I felt bad. <laughs> oh, no. In back. Hand. Yeah, How is Dog it? Out, let's go, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> How was that? The initial is really scary. <laughs> I will close my eyes. Yeah. I think that might be worse if you close your eyes. Oh my god. Oh no, now I'm scared. Ready? Oh, I think so. Ready? Okay, one, two, <laughs> go. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, Jay, Jay, Just kidding. Oh, my anxious stomach go going backwards. There you go. Uh, it's more backwards. Oh. <laughs> How was that, Liz? <laughs> uh, scary, but amazing. Well like, done. Yeah, I'm hyped now. Like this? Yeah, this is more. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Ready? Are you ready? Ready? One, yeah. two, go. Yeah! Yes. Ooh, how is it? It's all right. <laughs> yes! Higher! <laughs> it's good, isn't it? Pete, are, are, yeah. are you still with us? <laughs> Pete, how was it? Really um, exhilarating, to be fair. Yeah? Yeah, yeah you're going to love it. Like, yeah! That okay. first bit is very scary, but after that you do, you settle and yeah, it's relaxing. So, yeah. Yeah. yeah, but you haven't done it backwards yet. Was that worse? I love how you let me go first. Okay, thank you. I'm a gentleman, isn't it? Ladies yeah. first. Why have we gone so much higher? Try more now. Ah, stop. You. Okay. <laughs> One, two, go. Oh, oh, Lord. Oh, yeah. You didn't even swear, Lord. Let's go. Okay. Let go, you ready to let go? Come on, put your arms up. Yeah, it's fine here. Well done. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate that. Scale of 1 to 10, how scary? It's, I thought it was going to be a lot scarier, but you do feel very secure. Um, it's Ooh. exhilarating, it's a real good rush. So yeah, I enjoyed that. So you saw our reactions on the swing, <laughs> but we've both calmed down now, haven't we? We have calmed down. It was such a thrill that is yeah a real rush obviously the nerves were kicking in a little bit but we had the swing and then we've just eaten up there and we had the view of all the rice fields behind us it's just amazing seriously the guide has been immense hasn't he yeah he's like he treats you like he's never done it before but knows how to do everything mm -hmm. kind of thing he makes you feel really special um but we are literally we were talking over lunch and we were saying we're going from like High calm, high calm. So it's been an immense day and I think probably the best day of the we honeymoon so far. We've thoroughly enjoyed yourself. The day is not over. Uh, I think we've got one more stop at a waterfall. I think it's waterfall, yeah. So hopefully, you know, that'll be a couple more nice pictures and stuff like that. I just can't get over it. What a great day. We got it wrong. We're not going to the waterfall just yet. It would be weird to have your lunch and then go for a swim. So. We've come to the Holy Spring Temple. We're not too sure about this, have we? We haven't done, heard anything about it, so. No, but we're gonna wait and see what they tell us, and I'm sure it's gonna be beautiful in its own right. So we'll have a look round and we'll show you. Before we enter the temple, we've got to wear a Sharon, I think you call it. They're actually called a Sharon. A Sharon. Yeah, I think I look so right.
Holy Spring Temple and behind me is where they do the offerings and then that little platform just there you do your worshipping and then you get into the water and you are meant to uh, drink from each spring and splash yourself and wash yourself and bathe in it and then move on to the next spring. Each one represents uh, something different and as you can see there's offerings on all of them. You're not meant to drink or bathe from the 13th one. Uh, it's for the dead only apparently, um, if I've got that correct. There is a day, you have to register a day before, um, before you can go in the water and we didn't know about it but some of these people were taking real spiritual journeys. Uh, it's quite... That's a mind-boggling, refreshing to watch. It's, um, people have got so much faith. There's lots of these evil statues carvings outside the temple um, because they believe in two gods the good spirit and the evil spirit and apparently these carvings keep away from the evil spirits uh, they look pretty menacing <laughs> now we're inside the temple you can see the statues have changed so they're good to keep the good in spring it's been here for over a thousand years it's just incredible I've never seen anything like this before no. and the water is pure and always clean and you're not allowed in it that was a quick whistle stop tour around the temple but I've never seen anything like this before in my whole life. That was just insane. It's just, yeah, breathtaking, it's spectacular. Would you come back and do it and do go in the water? I think so, you? Yeah. yeah, I would. I would definitely do it. So if you get the opportunity to do it, definitely do it. We won't have the time. No. Um, but it's been an experience anyway. Yeah, it's and been a real experience. It's getting better and better and better. Definitely. Um, and we can try and keep this wrong as well. It took us about 45 minutes in the car to get here, but it's totally worth it. So yeah. now Lucy's gonna go and wash her hair. We're closer to the waterfall now, but for those of you that have a bit of difficulty getting up and down stairs, this may be a bit far for you. There's no lift and there's it's a lot of steps to go, right? And it's all very uneven, so. At the, before seeing it, I really wanted to go underneath it. Now seeing it, I think it might wipe me out <laughs> no, it's rope top so you can't go underneath it but you can swim in it if you want uh, it is dirty water from the rice so yeah. we're not going to swim in it today because we didn't bring our swimming trunks but we're going to try and get a little closer <laughs> This is the closest that we can get. Uh, there is a red flag up, so you're not actually allowed to go in the water. I don't know whether it's because the current's too strong or if the water's that bad. So Maybe a bit of both. But we're all right here. This is the last stop on our tour, yeah. and it has been a spectacular day. It's what a way to finish it. I was going to say, it's definitely one I'm never going to forget. This day has just been amazing. We have done so much. We were trying to like remember all that we've done, but it's been a long day. We were picked up at eight this morning, and we're not going to get back till seven. Um, so, Lucy can tell you, this cost. Uh, it costs fifty-one pounds each. It's just ridiculous. So that um, includes our lunch, uh, entry to all of this, and the tour guide, which yeah. is just. And the transfers. Yeah, I honestly, I can't highly recommend it. We're not here to sell it, but. But we have had yeah, an amazing yeah. day. Uh, we're probably going to sign off here because we don't know how long this vlog is going to be. <laughs> we've done so much today. Really felt that we've got to grip a little more with um, the Bali. Bali culture. So, the top, top day. It's going to take a lot to be today. It really is, but we will try. <laughs> we're going to. Thanks for watching, guys. Take See care. See you later.